Welcome or welcome back at I need help at C square. In this example, we have to find the measure of the angle HDG. We see this angle here. Uh, if the three polygons are regular polygons, it's very important to know about that thing. And now, first of all, I want you to take a look to this angle HDG. In fact, all the angles that go around D. If you notice, if I go around, I get 360. So that's my first statement I'm going to write here. The measure of angle HDG, which is the one we need to find out, plus the measure of this angle, which is HDE, plus the measure of this angle, which is EDC. plus the measure of this last angle, uh, CDG, is 360, right? So we go around that point D, we add all these angles, we should get 360. And now we need to find uh, for uh, each these angles. And I'm going to start to HDE, this angle here. That angle you see here is an interior angle for this regular polygon of three sides. Or if, you, if you're going to call that an equilateral triangle, that is fine. For that reason, I'm going to use this formula you see here. I have three sides for that polygon. And let me call it N1. Then I'm going to have 3 minus 2 times 180 divided by 3. So that may, it means 1 times 180 divided by 3, which means 180 divided by 3, which means 60 degrees. This angle here is 60 degrees. Well, let's go to the next one this angle here. And if you notice, that polygon has five sides. So I'm going to say n equals five. And to be sure it's different than the other one, I'm going to say n2. So then I'm going to have five minus two times 180 divided by five. So I'm going to end up with three times 180 divided by five. Okay, and now it's up to you how you do the math. I usually try to simplify things and I'm looking here 5 goes in in 180 uh, 36 times and I have 3 times 36 and that will be 108 and this angle here is 108 degrees okay and we have one more angles to find out which is uh, this angle right here okay for that for finding that angle we look into this polygon with four sides regular polygon uh, so n equals uh, 4 and we have 4 minus 2 times 180 divided by 4 here which end up with 2 times 180 divide by 4 and we have choices here I will simplify this way and I have 180 divided by 2 90 degree that is 90 degree angle and now we can go back to the original statement we have here measure of angle HDG plus HDE was if you remember 60 degree we have it here plus the measure of angles EDC, it's uh, the one we found, 108, plus the measure of angles CDG, this one, 90 degree, is 360. So we're going to combine the like terms here, which are the degrees 60, 108, and 90, And that will be 258 degrees. 
and the last step will be to subtract 258 on both sides and we have the final answer for this problem the measure of angles H D G will be 360 minus 258 and that will be 102 degrees if you enjoy this video clip don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help thank you